Hi, welcome to Team Woolly Sheep Reviews. So you now should be in a situation like this. I've spent the time now to double check that the S is the coloured wire and the G is the black wires. I've once again checked all my connections. It's a good time to check for any solder splashes or anything on the, any of the components because you do get sometimes a, a wire will flick and a little ball of solder will appear somewhere on the circuit board. So check, double check, make sure that everything is clean and everything is neat. I, I thought I'd show you this. I purchased um, an FR Sky 2.4 gigahertz. It's the RXSR receiver. That's RXSR. It's a full wave receiver, and it's got duplex telemetry. And look at the size on that. That is mental. Some people use the XM Plus, but. I went for this one, which is smaller than the XM Plus. 20 mil long by 10 mil wide. That is absolutely mental. So according to um, the Joshua Bardwell connections, we're gonna use the five volt connection that we've uh, enabled. And this one actually works on 3.5 volts to 10 volts. So we're gonna have five volts there and you can see the connections there there is going from the far side is a telemetry we got the s bus we got the five volt and then we've got the ground and then on the end is a, an rx6 what the hell is rx6 right rx6 is for something that we don't want so I'm going to basically, I've cut the wires to length and I'm going to solder the wires as I need them. And the only one I'm not going to connect is the RX6. I don't know what it is. So consult the manual for your particular type of receiver and then solder it on there. We now have a receiver and I have a buzzer. Now we can buy these buzzers quite cheap. You need the buzzer. The buzzer gives you arm indication, uh, warning, beeps. So it's well worth having a buzzer. But the most important thing of all, when you find you've lost your quadcopter because it's gone in the long grass, you will be looking for it using the buzzer. And I'm gonna connect it to the buzzer connections on the board there. And if you look at the, um, uh, you can see them in the bottom right hand corner on the side of the VTX. That is where the buzzer is indicated on this page. And it says buzzer, pause, buzz and egg. So the buzzer's going to go on. Thank you for watching Team Woolly Sheep Reviews. I hope you enjoyed this video and had as much fun as I did. Catch you soon, bye. Bye.